What's up, dude? I got some pizza. Finna do a Domino's mukbang. You already know what it is. Yeah. I'm tearing this shit up, y'all. Pizza good to fuck. Good job, man. So y'all They realize my boy tried. They realize Alvin tried. 
this is all good. Is it? I believe download a piece is better. Any other piece, please. I'm sorry, you can't go wrong with me. You just fucking can't, okay? You fucking can't. Yep, you can Damn, you disagree? You just can't. Oh, yeah. But this is boy Dolly, I already know. She got AKA fucking down. Here doing the mukbang with my squad. If you're new to my channel, man, comment what y'all like. Comment below what y'all wanna hear, what y'all wanna see. Hear a nigga talk about. You know what I mean? First of all, that one. And for the ones who already been on here, I got some friends who been watching me. Man, I'm sorry I have not been on here. I've been busy. I've been working. And on top of that, I got somebody that I'm cooling with, I'm kicking with, and I'm talking to. So I've been trying to put effort and show her time as well. It's working and stuff like that. And August is a, it's going to be a rough month for me, y'all, man. Just, I just pray the most y'all keep me in prayer. And then I got court shit going on. It's ridiculous. I'm going to tell y'all about this story, though. Well, I got a homeboy, right? I've been trying to help this nigga out. I'm like, try to get females and all that, bro. All that shit. Hold up. We get my mouth in. Damn, both everything in the bed, y'all. But okay. This nigga, right? Damn it. Hold on, let me cut his teeth down. Oh, oh, I got a product to show y'all. <clears throat> A little project, a little product. I'm gonna show y'all before I continue on. This right here, you need to go get you some of this. It's called Kenneth Cole Black. And if y'all wear cologne for um, some of y'all studs, and some of y'all uh, men, I don't wear all different types of shit. I stick to what I know. But this is a new fragrance that I got. And it smells amazing. And I rock like, I rock not a cook alone. And I rock, well, yeah, not. I used to rock Adidas, but I don't like it as much. I rock the not a cook alone, the one that's the light blue, not the dark blue one with the dark blue top that ain't really real not a cook. The one with the glass bottle say not a cook, and it's clear, the sky blue, like a light blue not a cook. That's the way y'all need to get to. That shit smells so fucking good. A lot of people wear not a cook. Not a cook costs a lot, but. Well, you can get it offline, probably about $50. In the mall, it probably run you by, it probably run you by 50 In the mall, too, if 80 round it off by 80 But Polo, y'all be wearing Polo, and Polo do not smell good. Yes, it's a neighbor and all that, but it do not smell good. It don't. I'm sorry, I don't like Polo. Polo cologne, I understand the Polo clothes. I rock Polo, but Polo cologne does not smell good. Y'all be tweaking with that shit. This shit right here. It smells good. It's called Kenneth Cole. You can get the shit offline. This is a, actually a gift to me. So the chick that I uh, be cooling with, um, kicking it with, she bought this for me. She thought I would like. I told her like cologne. She ended up buying me some of this. I didn't know, but it actually smells good. And I've been I've been rocking that shit ever since. Y'all know me, I can't talk to you at the same time. Shit, too good. <laughs> but, anyways, I got a homie, right? 
I just don't feel like he could get girls, man. He did. As a matter of fact, I think I put him on my live. On my own, one of my videos on YouTube. He on one of my videos. He's a cool person. He is. He's a cool person. But man, I be trying. I be trying to help. And this guy done went out plenty of times together. Me, him, my cousin, we all hung out. But it's just the fact that he always be the one that he try to talk to guys, but it don't. I, when I'm around, I don't see it. And I got a question for y'all: How would y'all feel if you had a friend? like this or a homeboy like this that can't really get girls but you try to help them out and then like the girl end up liking you it's not your fault you know what i'm saying i'm the type of person i'm not trying to i don't be trying to steal his shine at all i really be trying to help him out like i've tried to talk to females to him before like okay we was at whataburger one time we were supposed to go out and um uh, get some drinks we did but before that we sat in whataburger right these two chicks walked in you know, say so he was like, damn, they fine. You know, of course you see fine bitch walk through the day, go like that, she fine. But anyways, I was like, man, he seen this shy or something. I didn't know. I was like, I'm trying to get him for you. He ain't saying nothing. He's like, okay. So we sat there and I was talking to the two girls. Like one of the girls, she was fine. She came over to me. I let like, my homeboy, you know, what I'm saying want to talk to you and shit like that. You know, what I'm saying she was like, oh, I thought the number. So I was like, can I get your number and shit like that? She was like, oh, I thought it was for you. I was like. Nah, no, but she was fine, so she took my phone and she put her number in my phone. I was like, that wasn't me trying to steal his shot. I was just trying to get the girl for him. He tried to talk to the other girl. She really wasn't going. But I ended up talking to the other girl. It's just, it's crazy as hell, y'all. It, it was just funny how the shit worked out, bro. I'm watching the movie, y'all. But it was crazy. It was just crazy how it fucking worked out and shit like that. How it went, man. That wasn't my plan. That wasn't my intention of trying to get get it to work out. So I'm almost stud, right? He's cool. And this for my studs, man. If y'all have a homeboy who... He tell y'all he like y'all or whatever. Like, cause I got a homeboy who told me he liked me. You know what I'm saying? We still kick, we still cool, cause he ain't never tried me, so I'm cool with that. I'm the type of person that I feel like is anybody got freedom of speech and say what the fuck they want to say. Actions is, is what matters. I know some studs though they'll trip and they'll lose their mind and they'll be mad and shit like that about a lot of motherfucking things. They'll fucking be mad. Yeah, nah, bro. But anyways, man, I wasn't trying to steal the nigga shine and none of that shit, bro. It's just, it's crazy. But yeah, to my studs, I got a homeboy like that though. Who you know, what I'm saying he was just like, I like you and stuff like that. He he took went down the line telling me I'm a beautiful person, I'm a good person, I'm very confident, I'm a very ambitious person. He just went down the line telling me shit, and I was like, All right, babe, okay. I was already cool with him though, and I was like, I don't, I don't care about that shit, man. As long as you don't try me, we cool. 
I don't want to keep hearing about that shit either. And that was the only time he really said something about it. He said something about it or not. I ignored him. But he really just a cool soul, you know what I'm saying? And I know I'd have, I'd have had stud bros who I'd have told them some shit like this one nigga did that to them. They'd be no, bro, we can't be cool. We can't be cool. But it's my homeboy, but he a friend, so because he really, he look out, you know what I'm saying? He really look out. So I'm just like, them are the type of people you don't cut off just because, oh, uh, they said this or they told you how they feel about you and you don't you rock that way. Okay, you ain't got to rock that way, but they, they feel that way. It's better them. If y'all going to be friends, your friend or your homeboy should be comfortable enough to let you know how they feel about certain things. Just get it out their chest. Because I know if it was me and I was chilling with a girl or some shit, I want to get it out of my chest. We can still be friends. We ain't gonna stop being friends. But I'm about to get off here, y'all. My phone died. <laughs> and I'm watching my movie Lil Don't Cost the Thing. Love it, hip hop of Atlanta. I'm about to hit. I don't really watch it, but I'm finna watch it though. I'm gonna finish with this story later. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. I'm so sorry that I ain't been on here lately. I'm sorry. But I love y'all. I have, I work and everything, so I'll be busy. I'm sorry. But peace. It's your boy Dollar.